Hello, welcome fellow traders, AMP Futures here, presenting another how-to video. In today's video, we're going to demonstrate how to insert drawing tools onto a chart using the TradingView mobile app. Now, right now, we're looking at a micro E-mini S&P 500. On the bottom right corner of the TradingView mobile app, you'll notice where it says Ideas, and right above it, there's a little plus sign. So we're gonna go ahead and click that plus sign, and you'll see drawings on the top left corner. Now, the different available drawing tools that you can apply onto a chart are broken down into category groups. So for example, you have trend lines, Gannon Fibonacci, geometric shapes, annotation, patterns, forecasting and measurement, as well as visuals. Simply choose a specific category group and choose a specific drawing tool that you want to apply onto a chart. So for example, let's say we choose Fibonacci retracements. Once you choose a drawing tool, you'll see a crosshair activated on the chart. The next step is you want to move with your finger the crosshair on the chart where you want to draw the drawing tool from. So let's just say, for example, we want to draw it from the top of this particular bar here. We're going to release, and we're going to click anywhere on the chart, and now you'll see a circle appear. Now you can take your finger and drag on that circle to actually start drawing out the drawing tool. Release with your thumb once you're content of the display, and then click anywhere outside on the chart to officially apply it onto the chart. Now if you want to make any changes to the drawing tool, you want to click on the drawing tool, you'll see those two circles appear, and at the same time, on the top right corner, you'll have a shortcut menu up here as well. This allows you to change the font size, the color, some quick buttons as far as making adjustments to the actual drawing tool. But if you want to get into a deep, as far as changing the parameters and settings of the actual drawing tool, you want to make sure you click on the far right there with the button with three dots to the right of the trash can icon. Of course, the trash can icon is going to delete the drawing tool off the chart. Now, when we click the three dots, you'll see these different options here where you can lock, you can hide, you can remove and do other things with the drawing tool. But the main emphasis is at the bottom is the settings option. We click settings. This is going to allow us to change the style of the drawing tool, the coordinates, as well as visibility. Now keep in mind, every drawing tool has its different parameters that you can change, so the settings that you're able to adjust with the drawing tool will vary depending on what drawing tool you have applied onto the chart. So this one that we're looking at right now is specific to the Fibonacci retracements. Just make your changes accordingly. Click OK on the bottom right corner to apply the changes. Let's delete the drawing tool by clicking the trash can icon, and now it's removed. Let's do one more example. We're going to click the plus sign again, bottom right corner above ideas. We're going to select drawings. And then you'll see, again, the different category groups. So we'll keep it simple. We'll select trend line this time. There's that crosshair. We're going to move it to a location where we want to draw our drawing tool from. So let's just say there. Click anywhere on the chart, and you'll see a circle appear. And now we're going to take our finger and drag on that circle to actually draw the drawing tool. We're going to release once we're content with the display. And now the drawing tool has been applied. Now again, if you want to make any changes to the drawing tool, you click on the drawing tool with your thumb until those circles appear, and then you'll see that menu appear in the top right corner. So for example, we can change the font size, we can change the color, we can change the style of the drawing, the trend line. So whether it's a solid line, dashed line, dotted line, we could also get into the settings by clicking the three dots. And you can see here there's additional options compared to the Fibonacci retracement that we saw a moment ago. So we can change the style, the text, coordinates, as well as visibility. To delete the drawing tool once again, I'm going to click the trash can icon, and now it's been removed. And this is how you insert drawing tools using the TradingView mobile app.